children. I cannot imagine that for the next 50 years, they will have to have someone in the Supreme Court who has been accused of violating a young girl. What are you doing, sir? Republican Senator Jeff Blake confronted over his decision to support the confirmation of new Supreme Court Justice Brett Kavanaugh, despite allegations of sexual assault. It was one of the most powerful moments for the Me Too movement since it began, challenging the legitimacy of a judge to sit on the highest court in the United States and shape issues like women's rights for future generations. The actress who resurrected the hashtag MeToo almost 12 months earlier was among those protesting Kavanaugh's lifetime appointment, even though he'd repeatedly denied the allegations. I never tried to find justice for my pain because justice was never an option. Now it might be. We think the MeToo moment is a turning point in the fights around sexual violence and sexual harassment. Me Too erupted worldwide when Hollywood producer Harvey Weinstein was brought down by multiple sexual assault allegations from his past, for which he's now facing trial. The effect has been profound for organizations like Futures Without Violence. And we're seeing uh, dramatically increased requests for things like technical assistance. So my organization trains employers and works with unions on how to get rid of sexual harassment. But data from the Pew Research Center shows sexual harassment in the workplace is as polarizing as any other political issue in the U.S., whose president has often been the target of Me Too's anger. We found that Democrats are far more likely than Republicans to see men getting away with it and women not being believed as major problems. And if this has been a turning point for women across the world, some advocates are cautious about what it can achieve. Our U.S. Congress, for instance, hasn't reauthorized the Violence Against Women Act. It used to be easy and agreed upon, and now we're having to fight to get that passed. So we're by no means out of the woods. Even if that law has been given a short-term reauthorization until early December, lawmakers may be forced into more long-term action if voters continue to channel this movement at next month's congressional elections. Owen Fairclough, CGTN, Washington.